Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is JT from Above and Below the Belt. I have interesting news. The WBC orders Triple G to face Jamal Chalo uh, for to, uh, to face um, Canelo Alvarez in 2019. And um, what do y'all guys think about this? My opinion on this, um, it makes sense. Um, maybe for, well, I think it makes sense. Um, I mean, Canelo, because uh, I know Canelo was going to fight, uh, you know, Jamal Charlo uh, right now, or maybe he was. Maybe he still can do that because um, he got the right to pick who he want to pick. That's, you know what I'm saying? He got the right to pick who he want to pick uh, facing the, his next opponent. So, um, right now, um, Triple G versus uh, Jamal Charlo, uh, I, was think, I was thinking to myself as an, uh, Jamal Charlo, I was like, I was thinking like, well, this wouldn't even, why do I have to do this if I was Jamal Charlo? But I had to think about it. He's a boxer at the same time. So he's thinking like, I don't have no, I don't have too many big names in my resume. You know what I'm saying? So this is good for him because he haven't fought in, I think, what, April? So this is going to be a, a, a good fight for him to get him prepared for Canelo Alvarez. And then why, this is a thing too. You have to understand this. Canelo Alvarez didn't knock out Triple G in his second fight. So if if um if Jamal Charlo can knock out Triple G, because now he got the blueprint to how to uh, fight him, and that's what Canelo did. And matter of fact, people came before Canelo like uh, Daniel Jacobs and and a couple other fighters that fought um uh, Triple G. You know what I'm saying? So um the only thing with Jamal, he don't have the experience. And that's the thing that I, mean, I guess for most fighters, you know, saying up and coming fighters uh, th that they have, th their issues will be. But you know, what I'm saying, hey, he wanted to, um, he wanted to get close to that. He wanted to get them strapped. So this is this is shot. So um, he would uh, have to uh, beat uh, Triple G, and um, and then he get close to them straps. Hopefully, that if Canelo will we'll face him. Uh, I think in 2019, but we and that's not that's not, that's unsure. So I mean, but um, hey man, he, he got to roll with the punches too at the same time, man. Canelo, uh, Jamal Charlo, you know what I'm saying? Do I want to see a, a Canelo Alvarez fight right now in December? If 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 he gonna pick, uh, if Canelo's gonna pick uh, uh, Triple G? I mean, I mean, let me tell you something, man. I ain't. That pay, that fight might be on pay per view again. I'm thinking, but I'm not gonna pay for it. I ain't pay for the second. I ain't pay for the first one. So I'm not gonna. I'm not doing it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, not like. Do I want to see that? I want to see. I want to see. I want to see a new fresher uh, face in the ring with uh, Canelo. Even probably with uh, Triple G now. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but if Jamal, like I said, getting back at this again, going back, going back to this again, if Jamal. Uh, Charlo knock out Triple G, which he, he which he have a uh, hit the cameras at all, have been knocked down, have been knocked out. If he knock him down and knock him out, whatever, man, that's that 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 tell that tell you where he where he at. You know what I'm saying? But you know if he get a decision and and, and uh, uh I'm talking about uh, uh uh not even like a doubt that he didn't that he won. You know what I'm saying? I mean a good decision, a a, a size this uh. Uh, 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 no, no questions that Jamal Charlo won. I can see that to a certain point, but at the same time, he got the blueprint and he's not, he's, uh, he's facing a, uh, uh, Triple G, which he lost. So he should have the blueprint, like I said. But, um, what do y'all guys think about this? You know what I'm saying? Cause I was thinking, like, man, man, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting a dude who don't got the belts no more. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it just, it, it, He's got he got he's got to go through a lot of things to get to the straps. I realize that too at the same time. I know he he thinking that too right now. You know what I'm saying? So, but hey, he don't he he don't um control boxing when it comes to that situation, but he do control himself so who you want to fight, but this is who who he need to fight to get to them belt. So, but we'll see. Um what do you guys think? Uh leave a comment at the bottom of my page. Uh like my page, subscribe to my page. Hit the bell icon for new notifications and new videos from me. This is JT from Above and Below the Belt. Bye-bye.